Dallas Linux. Today is Tuesday, January 11th, 2022. Ari and Jada and I are happy to share today's news with you. We are from Miss Pajeska's third grade class. Let's start by pledging allegiance to the flag of our great United States. Please stand, place your right hand over your and or begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please return to your seats. Now here's Jada to bring you more of today's news. Thank you, Anthony. Good morning, everyone. Partly... Cloudy skies are expecting today in Umstead Falls, and the temperature will reach a high of 25 degrees. The cafeteria is getting a healthy lunch ready for you. If, if you are buying lunch, your choices are pizza dippers or chicken patty. Now over to you, Aria. Thank you, Jada. And now this week's Copying Good Students and also Perfect Returns for the Library. Hi, everybody. It's Mrs. Kenachi here. Mr. Dame is not here. It's Monday, but you'll see this on Tuesday. But he wasn't here on Monday, so I'm doing the morning show. And first, our joke of the week from Mrs. Dre's class. Why the banana go to the hospital? I don't know why. Because it wasn't peeling right. Uh, Thank you, Mrs. Dre's class, for a joke of the week. Now, on to business. Perfect turn-ins. First grade. Uh, we'll just move on from there. <clears throat> no, first grade. Second grade. Second grade perfect turn-ins. Mrs. Warmoker and Mrs. Wallow. Nice job. Yay! Woo! That's a state trip. She's over there. She's all happy. So keep it in. Uh, <coughs> third grade, we'll just move on. Oh. First grade, copying good. Uh -huh. Camille, Camille from Miss Crawford's class. She was safe and responsible. Keep it up, Camille. I like it when we're safe and responsible. Next up, we have Andrew from Miss Pate's class. Andrew, I did the right thing. Hmm. I do love when we do the right thing. And doing the right thing is not always the easy thing to do. So, Andrew, you keep that up, man. Spicy's proud of you. She's over here. She's whispering to me. So. You're very proud, Andrew. Next up, second grade. In Mrs. Wallace's class, we have Jenny. Jenny was cleaned up the Play-Doh without being asked. And every art teacher in the world loves somebody who will clean up things without being asked. So excellent job, Jenny. For, super proud of you. And in Miss Stott's class, we have Maddie. I handled the change, even though I felt mad. It's even harder to do the right thing when we aren't happy about something. So Maddie, that is an excellent Caught being good and being respectful. Really nice job. You should keep that up. Last up, we have third grade. Kyra and Mrs. Stovasek's class did the garbage. And I'll tell you what, in my house, doing the garbage, that's a big deal. So kudos to you for doing the garbage, man. Nice job. And in Mr. John Henry's class, we have Annie E. I was walking in the hallway. Hmm, I seem to remember Mr. Dame and I often speaking of walking in our hallway. So you know what? Definitely a cut being good slip that I am all for walking in the hallway. Because I caught a few of you today. Mm hmm I did. So Spicy is here just because I wanted to come visit. And Frosty is here to remind you that it is getting cold outside. So even if we aren't going outside because it's too cold for recess, you still have to get on the bus, walk into the building. Please make sure that you are wearing warm coats your hats, 
your mittens, your gloves, your boots. And if you need any one of those things, or if you've lost them, please let one of us know, either your teachers or someone in the office, so we can make sure we can either look for your lost stuff. There's a bunch of lost stuff I saw over there in the cafeteria. And here it is. I'm just giving you guys a quick look. If you see something that looks like yours, I would come get it because it's getting cold outside and I'm sure someone at home is asking, where's your sweatshirt? Where's your jacket? So take a look. If you see anything that's yours, come to the cafeteria and pick it up during your lunchtime. Yeah, might want to check that out. And if you do need something, let us know so we make sure that you can stay nice and warm when it's cold out. Thanks, guys. Have a good day. Talk to you later. Be your bulldog vest for a chance to hear your name announced. That's our news for today. Have a terrific Tuesday. And let's go, folks!